Good morning, everyone. It's 5th of November, Saturday morning, and I was going to do a 50 euro uh, challenge where I was going to go and buy souvenirs in all the different shops available in, in uh, Wexford Town for the value of roughly 50 euros, and then I was going to randomly select a tourist and give it to them as a gift. Unfortunately, not able to do it today because I've been poisoned by the state. Quite frankly, it's just a water notice was presented on Wednesday at 6 p.m. However, I've been drinking about four pints of water that day and I started to feel rather nauseous. And basically, we, I contracted Gardia, which is um, it's a water-based uh, um, parasite that's in water. Uh, it's passed on usually by animals, feces, that has got its way into the water system. Now, in, in Ireland, the last few, last last year or so, every time we seem to have a lot of rain, in which the last five, six days, we've had a lot of rain in, in Wexford, and the um, we ended up usually getting a boil water notice. Now, the thing is, by the time they give the boil water, boil water notice out, there are already people have been infected with it. We uh, About a year ago, there was a, about 20 people hospitalized up in Gorey. So it does happen quite often. So... If you're visiting into Ireland, we have our own care, especially in Wexford, because each water area treatments are different. But in Wexford, it seems to be that you, if there is a lot of rain, we usually get followed up with a water notice, uh, boil water notice, and you have to be proactive and drink water bottles and that. So I, you know, this is a, I wasn't able to work Thursday, Friday, I tried to work, but I had to stop around 10. I just wasn't able to, wasn't able to concentrate. Basically, it's just, it's not very good. You get diarrhea and your stomach is upset and and stuff like that. So, and just to be be cautious, if you're visiting Ireland and you're in the sunny southeast and we do have a lot of rain, uh, it behooves you to maybe drink the old the old water bottles and stay away from the the taps for the time being. Um, well, we did get a a notice. Um, that explained what the uh, the disease or the parasite was the, uh, found in the water supply, and that was given us on the second of November at around five fifty in the evening. I'll post up the the warning up here so you can take a look at it. Um, there is, you know, it is it, it does happen. Um, the only thing that I found that there is a f fault in our system is that we have a lot of Ukrainians over since uh, March. Um, a lot of them have limited English, so they might not have got the warning because mostly it's just residents that receive a text or an email if they've subscribed to uh, the warning system. And also we have a lot of Syrians that are here in Afghanistan, people from, you know, fleeing uh, the conflicts that, that are going on there, and they have limited English, so they won't be, you know, accessible to all this information. Um, for myself, like, you know, I'm going to get over it. It's not the end of the world. I missed, uh, you know, almost two days work. Um, uh, I was feeling really poorly on Wednesday night, Thursday. I couldn't, couldn't function Friday. I tried, I spent about three hours at work, but I had to log off cause I just wasn't able to concentrate. And today I'm not feeling well, so I'm not able to do my vlog I wanted to do. So it's our version of the deli belly. I don't know what we'd call it. The... The Wexford Wobbler or something like that but uh, you know it's something that we have to look at and how do we reach out to the whole community to make sure they know and also we have visitors here visitors that wouldn't say so that's why I'm sort of warning is if you come into Wexford you know and if there is a lot of rain and that avoid the uh, the water drink the uh, the bottled water um, you know it's a little training for for me when I go to Nepal maybe to strengthen my belly so I can enjoy the penne puri uh, and other street things. I know I'm going to avoid the ice and the water, uh, but you know there is some street foods I want to want to try when I get over there. I know we had tried to pass a law a few years ago about uh, uh, water taxes, like water when we don't pay for water, um, and the argument was that the infrastructure needs to be rebuilt, and that money was supposed to be going towards that. It hasn't been done yet, so you know. It is an antiquated uh, system that we have in places and it does need refurbishment and these are side effects, I guess. And also the treatments are, you know, when we do get a lot of water, it does have overflow. So, 
I'm going to put up a link of what Gardia is, and I'm going to show you the little nice little diagram of what the actual parasite looks like. But next week, hopefully, if I'm if I'm lucky enough, I'll be able to get downtown. I'm going to go do a 50 year old challenge. I'm going to go out and go to town, show you all the nice little shops that you can buy some souvenirs. I'm going to pay about 50 euros, which should give you a nice little grab bag of stuff. And then I'm going to hand it off to a random tourist. And I was hoping to do it today because there's still the people in the opera festival around town at the tail end of it. And you have the people in the, the Spiegel tent till around, still around town. But Wexford does have a lot of tours all year round. So I should be able to find that. I'm going to leak some of my uh, links below of all the different uh, vlogs I've done recently. Um, like I said, I'm planning to do... A few around, I have to still do Kirklow Beach. I want to do uh, Tintern Abbey. I want to do the Hook Lighthouse. And then maybe I might go up to Ferns and Gory area uh, before I venture out into likes of Kilkenny and Cork and, and places like that. But if you have any suggestions, please comment below on where you'd like me to vlog. And then, like I said, in September next year, September, October, I'm planning to go to Nepal for uh, a month and do the Langtang Valley Trek and a few other places. There's a, I'm starting to do my homework. I got a lot of list of places to, to show you. Really interesting event at places. Um, so stay with me and don't forget to uh, subscribe to my channel. Hit the bell button for to be notified of the new vlogs. And thank you very much for watching.